We're going on a day on a picnic. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, I'm going. I don't know about you. Smell me. I like it. You like it? I want this. You want to, you want this? Mmm, you smell good. Ooh, this is a really Hold on. I'm gonna need some of this too. No. Dab 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 put it on your neck. <laughs> Shout out to Dossier for sending me all four of these good smelling perfumes. I thought that they were just gonna send me two. They pay, okay, so they paid me to try them, which I have the best job ever. And I thought they were only gonna send me two, but they sent me four. So shout out to y'all because each and every one of them smells a little bit different. Like they have unique smells. Some of them even bring me back to like some memories. If you guys haven't heard about Dossier, you guys are literally asleep. I'm about to put y'all on. Dossier is like a high-end brand line of perfumes and colognes. They're giving you quality price perfumes and colognes for a fraction of the price. And who doesn't let us save money? I know I do. They don't just have designer quality perfumes. They also have like lower quality perfumes. Any scent, the lowest one is $39, while the more pricier in designer is from $50 to $280. I've actually been wearing it for the past couple days before I decided to come on camera and talk to you guys about it, because like I said, they paid me to try it, and I want to give you guys my honest review. Okay, let me smell. I keep forgetting the name of my favorite one. They all smell good, but my favorite one is the Amber Cherry. Oh, it smells so good. I noticed when I use my Victoria's Secret one versus this one, this one lasts way longer. Never had to spray it again throughout the day if I'm out and about versus Victoria's Secret. You know you gotta spray it more. They have great deals and even free shipping when you get like three bottles. They have a risk-free system. They allow customers to try the perfume before you 100% commit to them. So if you decide that you don't like any of them, you're going to get a free return or exchange, no questions asked. So boom, you shop with them and you're not only getting an affordable price for quality product, you're also going to get a 10% discount on top of that because they love your girl and I love you so much. So I got y'all a 10% discount code, which is Vanessa Lynn 10. Every time you make a purchase, you're going to get 10% store credit for every order. So there's literally no reason to not try them. Shout out to them. We love to save our coins. If you do try them, let me know. All the information that I just gave you will be in the description. But let's get this show on the road. It is time. It's time to start getting ready. I didn't even eat yet. Oh my God, what am I doing? I haven't done a get ready with me in a long time and we're going on a picnic date, sis. Yeah, so. we can go with the people. Uh-oh. I don't know why she in the camera. She not coming to the picnic. Yeah, we're going to do that and we're going to get our outfit together, sis. It is currently 11 in the morning. We got a long time. I'm supposed to be there by 4, so... Wish me luck. It's a whole day process. I think this will be my first picnic ever, so I'm super excited about it. First things first, let's start off with, I wanna say let's start off with taking the wig off. So I'm gonna take it off and then I'm gonna wash my face and then I'm gonna wash my face. I'm gonna show y'all, let's just get Let's just get started. One thing about me, I cannot get ready or do anything proper without playing music. So play some Nicki Minaj. Okay, here's Nicki Minaj. Thanks sis. First things first, we safely, very, very carefully removing our lace. We're safely loosening up the glue from the wig because we want our edges. We do not not want edges, you know what I mean? Like, this is supposed to be a protective hairstyle and y'all are not protecting y'all hair with some of y'all protective hairstyles. And let me just say this, it couldn't be me because I love and adore my natural hair. Nah, cause this literally comes off like butter and I love it. Shout out to my old hairstylist for putting me on. Whenever it gets stuck like that, I never pull. I just spray some more or rub it and it'll come off. It usually comes off within like 10 seconds, but it says it could take up to like a minute. Period. When you look in your lace, you should not see your natural hair attached to it. And you cannot see my natural hair attached to it. And I've actually had this wig on for like a week or two. I'm about it. Now I'm going to put a bunch 
on my hair because I'm actually going to wash it for the next style that I'm trying to do. Y'all wish me luck because I've never done this style before. I just pray it comes out how I envisioned or better. I'm going to try to incorporate what I'm trying to do. Two high ponytails and a swoop and I'm just learning and mastering the swoop so just just pray for me let's see how long it takes the worst part is taking off the sideburns because that's the part you have to put the most glue on so your wig doesn't fall off so it takes some time you got to really work that thing in there but i'd rather take my time than use like alcohol and like rip out my hair i love my hair i wish it was thicker but in cases like these when i'm putting on a wig i'm so glad that i'm just able to put it in like two braids and call it a day because it makes the taking out process so much easier i hate when i get my hair done by stylists and they braid my hair in a bunch of small little braids because my hair doesn't really need it and taking them out is so freaking hard and i risk ripping my hair off shout out to all the standruff and product build up oh my god this, this feels so good one side done other side to go if you know you know how this feels shout out to my five head it's super red and irritated it always does that when i take it out and i regret every time doing my hair the day that i take it out because i'll be needing low key for it to rest and chill but we ain't got time for that i literally have to be gone in three hours so i have to hurry up so here is my hair dry crusty musty let's wash it all right all clean i did a clarifying shampoo which i haven't done in a little while and i also did a hair detox mask the very first time and it was burning my scalp because i was itching it so much and the detox mask has apple cider vinegar so it was like burning but it does feel like my scalp is clean and i really hate hair like i hate doing my hair but like this time I actually did it in my sink because I have like a really big deep sink instead of the bathtub and I feel like it went by so much faster, so much smoother. This is the new product line that I'm trying out. They sent me some stuff and I'll keep you guys updated on how it goes. I'm going to try to use them exclusively so I can actually see if there's a difference. Anyways, so I'm going to apply weave but I'm going to style my real hair first. Let that dry and while that's drying then I'll be doing my makeup. I'm not going to lie, I have no idea what I'm doing. Parted it down the middle. Now I'm about to do this side swoop thingy. <sighs> okay, dandruff. Just ruining everything. I got this got to be spray. I got this one because it looks fancy. It says spray. It says spray wax. What? So I actually did watch some videos before filming this, so I wouldn't fail completely. And everybody is just using got to be spray, so I feel like I feel like I'm doing something here. I feel like we're going we're going to get it right. Let me take out my edges now before I don't have any. Like Shut up. Letting that thing out. I'm going to do it as high as possible because I know once I put the ponytail in, it's probably going to drop a little bit. It's so satisfying that my nails match my hair. The hair tie, I get them really long because the shorter ones, I feel like I can't get enough passes, like how I'm passing it, one pass, two pass. I don't get enough out of them and like my hair be loose and I like really tight ponytails because that's just going to give you that lifted look. Is it even? I think so. I'm gonna do it in parts because that's how I saw other people do it. Okay? You don't finish your hair. Okay. I am a failure. I ended up doing my hair off camera because my camera ended up dying. Like both of my batteries were dead. The swoop is dead. It literally took me so long. It was making me so mad and frustrated. I almost called it off. So the sun is still out. I think if I leave in an hour, it'll be fine. I've been touching my face unintentionally ever since I started doing my hair though. So I'm gonna wash it again and then we're gonna do our makeup. We're gonna do a quick look because we gotta get out of here. It's literally taking everything in me to not cancel. 
and that's so you can't flake you can't flake you gotta do this i wanted to do like curly weave but that was gonna take way too long so i just straightened it off camera before i even wrapped it and that saved me so much time i feel like that made it so much easier i'm kind of nervous but not that nervous i have more anxiety because i'm running out of time than anything else wish me luck i ain't lose you lose my just logistics this is what happened when i think about you Nah, girl, I got a job for you. Swear to God, I could do it live for you. Bitches ain't shit, and they ain't saying nothing. Nikki, 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 put it in your kitty. When we're rapping, I'll be trapping. When we're trapping, I'll be kicking. I better find your loving. I better find your heart. Get your bag. Oh, 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 oh. Don't kill me now. Come on and turn me really 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 don't need to add these bottom lashes but i am because we've already made it this far might as well go a little further finishing touches and i gotta get ready oh my goodness time is not ever on my side let me tell you something i hope the person who asked me how i put lashes on with long nails is watching this because literally my nails serves me like tweezers it actually makes it easier the most important thing is to make sure that the glue is a little bit tacky that way it's not like moving everywhere Woo. Woo, period. <laughs> now for the fit i don't know what to wear i don't know y'all what y'all think should i go in a dress i don't know maybe i feel like that'll be like too uncomfortable i got so many options i don't Wednesday, no. Fancy shirt that look like I'm going to a club. Um, um, um. <laughs> decisions, decisions. What color? My hair is green. I can't just wear anything. I feel like if I wear too many colors, I'm going to look childish. So I think I should do like a nude or something. Okay, these are hoodies. I don't. Oh, for tiff or dat. For tiff or dat scavern. Do y'all know? <laughs> Come if y'all know what sound that is or where that's from. Do I wear leggings? Do I wear jeans? So many decisions. I don't like how open this is. Like, it just looks so plain. So, we're going to throw on a necklace. Oh, look at butterfly. Butterfly. Fun fact. Vanessa means butterfly. Okay. Chain on. Earrings on. Period. I probably add some nose cuffs and stuff. But I'm pretty sure we're running out of time. So, let me just put some regular jeans on. Get out of camera because I ain't trying to have you two flag me. Last but probably not least, perfume. We gotta smell good. Which one are we gonna wear? I feel like we should. Okay, there we go. I had to change the settings. But I don't know which one I should do. This one is my favorite. So I guess I'm gonna go with this one. corner of my bathroom because I've been trying to get ready this whole time. Yeah, I was about to be on my way. It's getting kind of late though. I know you still wanted to do it. Hold on. Y'all, it's dark outside. I've been in the bathroom this whole time. I don't know what to say. <clears throat> Hello. I'm sorry. <laughs> do you want to do it? Do you want to like do it another day or? Yeah, we can do it sometime this week if, uh, when I be free. All right. Sorry. It's all good. All right. Bye. No. Oh my god. What do I do? Should I go? Should I be like? Should I call back? I feel so bad. And then I took all this time to get ready. Should I call them back and be like, come over, like get some pizza? Cause if not, I wasted my time. Or I can, you know, just pop up on the gram, you know what I'm saying, a girl, cause I, I don't ever post. As badly as I want to invite them over, I just don't want to give off the wrong impression cause it is late, it's like nine o'clock. How did I let this happen? That's the first time. That's how y'all know I was really into like the music and stuff. But it's okay, there's more times, there's more days. It took me every ounce of energy to get ready today, but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm just gonna go to TikTok and then go to sleep. Right, right, 
period. So in conclusion, make sure y'all are getting ready days ahead of time. If y'all going on a freaking picnic date or something, make sure y'all outfits and stuff is ready ahead of time, hairstyle, all of that. So y'all not like me. If y'all interested in the dossier, perfumes that information will be in the description nose cuffs in the descriptions nose cuffs made by me i love you nice again thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye